Hello guys! Ayan, kamusta, kamusta, kamusta? At ito na nga ang continuation ng ating first vlog nung papunta tayo ng Coron via to go. And we are heading now to Tag Resort Coron. On time kaming pinag-disembark, kaya naman napaaga kami. Ayan, good morning guys! So, we are already here sa loob ng um, sundo namin for Tag Resort. And ayan, maaga kami nag-disembark. So, around mga 6 a.m. na nakapag-disembark na kami. And nakababa na kami by... Ayan, kulit. <laughs> nakababa na kami by uh, 6.30. So, nag-wait kami ng konti. And then, dumating na yung aming uh, sundo from Tad Resort. So, ayan. And ayun na nga. Actually, nakapunta na kami ng Coron. Pero that was year 2017 pa. So, medyo matagal-tagal na rin. That time, mag-boyfriend and girlfriend pa lang kami ni Jane. Hindi pa kami mag-asawa. But ngayon, kasama na namin si Baby Kyrie sa aming mga travels. O diba, that was 2017. Tapos ngayon, 2023 na. After ilang years, mag-asama na kami yung chikiting sa aming mga travels. So, mas makikita nyo na si Baby Kyrie sa aming mga vlogs. After a few minutes, nakarating na kami dito sa Tag Resort. Ang lawak ng lugar, grabe. Sobra, sobrang lawak, promise. Yung tipong pagbaba mo pa lang, matutuwa ka na kaagad. I think tumating kami dito around 7, 7.30. So, super aga talaga ng check-in namin. Buti nilang pumayag din ang tag resort na mag-early check-in kami. And mabilis lang yung pass ng pag-check-in. Tapos maya-maya mag-breakfast na kami. At dahil naka-early check-in nga kami, meron din kaming early breakfast. So, thank you for the early breakfast, tag resort. The restaurant here in tag resort is called Puntag. Puntag in Bisaya which means umaga in Tagalog or morning in English. Buntag Restaurant serves food daily. And actually, nakakatawa kasi every morning, there's a buffet. And also, there's a great selection of delectable foods and dishes, pagtanghali, and evening. So, ito yung mga makikita natin sa kanilang buffet tables. As you can see kanina, nandun yung mga main dish. And this one is the egg station. I think I asked for an omelette for this one. So, yun. Niluto na siya. You can also find here the salad station, the congee station, and actually may champorado nga rin dyan. So syempre dahil mahilig tayo sa champorado, kukuha tayo nyan. Katabi nyan ay yung mga bread and pastries naman. We also have fruits in here. So talagang every morning, complete ang nutrition na makukuha ninyo to energize your day. They also serve a brewed coffee, but if you want an upgrade like gusto nyo na may favor, so there's an additional price na. At ito naman yung request ni Mommy. Chocolate flakes with milk! At meron pala siyang in-order na hot choco. Yeah, hello guys! So, we're having our breakfast now at Buntag here in Tag Resort Coron. So, ayan. Ito yung aming mga kinuha for today. Ayan, ayan may binigay na bagong egg si Sir Norbert for Baby Kairi. Ay, at may hinulog na naman ako tsara si Baby Kairi. Vloggers team. Mga vloggers team parents. Hello! Hello Baby Kairi. Hello down, hello. Green Life Jollibee. Ang ganyan na sir. Baka natapos. Yum yum na, yum yum. Sarap naman. Ayan, after namin mag-breakfast, syempre tuwan-tuwa na sa Baby Kyrie kasi mag-check-in na kami. And isa nga pala nakakatawa dito sa Tag Resort, Coron, is their advocacy to help conserve energy. At syempre, most of all, pagiging eco-friendly. Kaya naman, they have this tricycle or tuk-tuk that can take you from any point inside the resort. So, in our case, papunta kami sa aming room. Meanwhile, enjoy the view!
Okay, and we are approaching our room na. Our room is located in room 109, Tahanan Villa. Or you can also say Tahanan Suites. And hello guys, so we're currently here at our um, room na, Tahanan 109. And papakita sa inyo yung facilities and amenities dito sa Tag Resort Coron. Ayan, so first off, diba, kita-kita nyo naman yung view. Nandiyan yung parang, hindi naman siya Mount Tapias, pero isa siya sa mga hill dito sa uh, Coron. And, andito yung mga tahanan villas, or, ayan, yung mga, yung building na yan is the tahanan suites. And, right there, ayan, dyan yung room natin, tahanan 109. So, pasok na tayo. Ayan, so, syempre meron tayong balcony dyan sa labas. And, yung, ito, ang tawag dyan, parang, sampayan. Nasa loob na sila, Jane. So, papasok na tayo sa ating Tahanang Hardin 109. Ayan. So, ito yung room natin. Meron tayong sofa. And, syempre, si Baby Kyrie at ang kanyang mommy. Yay! <laughs> Ops, nagbe-breastfeed kasi. So, dito tayo. So, meron tayong TV. Hindi pa namin na-on. But, basically, makikita natin yan later on. Um, yung nakita nyo naman yung king-size bed. Diba? Plus, yung ating ceiling fan. Aircon is right there. Split type. And, syempre, yung ating uh, wardrobe area or vanity area din pala. Yan. So, meron tayong dalawang hanger dyan. At tatlo. Tapos meron tayong uh, flashlight, emergency, and yung ating bolt. And syempre yung Bible. Tapos, the good thing is, we also have here the mini refrigerator with complimentary water. Plus, um, your coffee machine. So, ito yung ating coffee machine. We have coffee pods here, nakasama. Ayan. And, ang sabi sa amin, if kulang yung coffee pods, request na ng bago. So, ganun. So, kapag nag-check-in kayo dito, ayan, meron kayong libre yung coffee everyday. And, proceed naman tayo sa ating bathroom. For Tahanan 109, ito yung itsura ng bathroom. Ayan, hot and cold shower. Meron ng soap and shampoo. Ito syempre yung gitna. Nandiyan yung ating towels, yung um, sink, and hand soap, sanitizers, yung ating mga toiletries. And on the other side is the toilet. Super cute, super aesthetic. Ayan, mag-enjoy ko sa sear na to kasi malaki. O, diba? Super nice. And dahil ka malaki yung CR, pwede kayong sabay dito na maligo. Sabay-sabay. And as for us, na family, syempre pwedeng sabay-sabay. Diba, baby Kyrie? Baby Kyrie! Baby Kairi, oh. Ayan, oh, diba? Ang ganda. Ah, paano ito yung turo ni Baby Kairi? Ceiling fan? Ano yung ceiling fan? Saan ceiling fan? And from this side of the bed, syempre, nandito na yung ating balcony. Wow! Diba? Imagine that. Ang ganda ng view. Ang ganda ng location. Napakalaki ng lugar. So, muna pang further developments ang magaganap dito sa Tag Resort. And can't wait to see that in the future years. Ayan. On behalf of my wife and Kairi, thank you Tag Resort for having us. We also had the privilege para makita kung ano ang nasa loob ng Tadhana Suites. So this is the inside of a Tadhana Suite. 
So the Hannah Suites are like a private or intimate place for a couple or honeymooners or even your own family. If you are booked on a Tadhana Suite, you have your own exclusive pool use and only those booked in Tadhana Suite can use the pool. So yes, that is really an exclusive area for those who are booked in Tadhana Suites. The best thing about being booked on a Tadhana Suite is that you have your own pool view every morning, every day, every night. So imagine nyo, pagkagising nyo, ito na agad yung mabungad na view sa inyo. Di ba sobrang nakakatuwa, nakakagaan sa feeling? And feel na feel mo na special ka talaga. So if you want a more private or intimate feel, book that Hannah Suite. Thankfully, we were given the privilege or access para maka-explore tayo dito sa Tadhana Suites. So although we are both at Tahanan, masyari tayo kasi mapapakita namin sa inyo kung ano yung itsura or area itong Tadhana Suites. Siyempre, hindi namin palalagpasin na ma-experience ang pool at ang ambience dito sa Tadhana Suites. So ayan, yeah, nagtapis lang si Baby Kyrie. Excited na siya. Pati ang mommy actually excited na excited talaga. Kitang-kita nyo naman, pumusing agad si madam. Sa ganda ba naman kasi ng view at ng area, hindi ka ba mapapaposing talaga. So we decided na mag muna at magpalit para naman full na ma-experience namin talaga yung pool dito sa Tadhana Suites. So this is the bridge na papunta doon sa Tadhana Suite. Ang access lang kasi sa area is either that you are booked or dadang kayo dito sa bridge. Siyempre, may dila kaming salbabida. At dapat ready ka talaga kasi nga, may bibig kang kasama eh. Siyempre, dapat mag enjoy din siya, di ba? Ayan, hello guys! So we're currently here at Tadhana Suites. So, Harding Tadhana ang tawag dito sa, um, sa tag. So, dito sa Tadhana, dito yung mga ano natin, ang tawag dito, yung kumbaga pag pool view or pool side view, ayan, ito yung mga rooms na available for that. Tapos, ano rin siya, parang honeymoon suite or marital suite, ayan, depende sa inyo kung paano siya i-incorporate sa inyong mga utak, but ayun nga. So, as you can see on the previously re released video, nandun kami sa ano, uh, Tadhana M kanina. And yun yung view namin. So, ayun si Baby Kyra rin nagsuswimming na kanyang mommy. And actually, this pool is for um, exclusive guests lang ng uh, mga Tadhana, Tadhana Suites or Harding Tadhana. Ayan. Yan. So, ikot lang tayo mabilis. Pero actually, na-walk na ko naman na kayo kanina. So, hindi lang akong masyadong mag-ikot. Pero, ayun. Isa sa mga magandang areas talaga dito sa Tag Resort, Coron. Wah, wow, umulan! At antok na ang aming baby! <laughs> Sleep na ba yan si baby Kairi? Sleep na, sleep na. Ayan. So, ito ang itsura dito sa Tag Resort kapag umuulan. Majestic pa rin and napakaganda pa rin. Grabe. Super enjoy, super nakakatawa dito. Sarap. Ready. Okay, Rio. Oh. Wow, serap naman. <laughs> serap naman tampi sa unyan. Oh, nag-enjoy talaga, oh. Enjoy na, enjoy naman yung sa tubig. And syempre, dapat habang nagsusimming, meron din kong family picture. Kaya naman para ma-achieve namin ang family picture na kailangan or gusto namin, eh nagdada talaga kami ng tripod. Ang tripod na ginagamit namin is Yunteng brand. I'm not sure if makikita ninyo but I'll put 
the link in the comments or in the description below. So, ayan. Ayan. So, ito yung isa sa mga pinakamagandang corners dito sa bandang pool area ng uh, Tadhana Villas. I'm going to go to the water bed. After namin mag-swimming, eh, syempre nag-freshen up na kami. And uh, dito kami nag-lunch sa Taza Cafe. Yung Taza Cafe is nasa labas lang siya ng Tag Resort. Kumbaga, nasa outside area lang siya. So makikita nyo siya kaagad. At kaya naman dito kami kumain sa Taza Cafe. Dahil meron silang lunch promo. 80 pesos lang kasi yung rice bowls nila. Kaya sobrang mura talaga. Actually, mas mahal pa nga yung kape. <laughs> And the ambience is good talaga. Watch the preview para matuwa din kayo. And let's take a look naman sa ibang areas nitong Tag Resort. On our first day, nag-tour natin pala kami. We booked our tours naman via the Palawenyo Travel and Tours dito sa Coron. Ang Palawenyo Travel and Tours ay isa sa mga trusted um, tour companies and agencies dito sa Coron. Actually, since nakapunta na kami ng Coron noong 2017, we decided to skip the other parts ng town tour. For this tour, kami ay pupunta sa Makinit Hot Springs. At kung hindi pa ninyo alam, kasoy ang isa sa mga primary products dito sa Coron. And this is what a kasoy looks like. Yehe! Pupunta na si baby kay Risa, Makinit Hot Springs! And so ito na yung bagong rates natin for Makinit. Yan, 300 per packs na siya. Don't worry though, kasi kapag kumuha kayo ng tour sa Palawan Yung Travel and Tours or any other agencies, walang na kayong babayaran na entrance fee. Ngayon, by this point, kami naman ay naghahat na ng area para makapagpalit ng damit. Merong mga designated uh, or available na dressing areas dito sa loob ng Makinit Hot Spring. Ayun, sorry kung hindi ko na na-videohan yung dressing area, pero madali lang naman makita yun. And we are already here sa Makinit Hot Spring sa Coron. Makinit Hot Spring is a salt water hot spring. So if titikman ninyo yung tubig mula sa hot spring na yan, ito ay talagang maalat. Ayon sa guide, merong underwater volcano dito sa Coron. And that's what makes the water hot here in Makinit. According to the guide as well, the temperature in Makinit Hot Spring ranges from 36 degrees to 40 degrees. And napaka-therapeutic talaga ng tubig dito sa hot spring na to. Actually, madami nga daw ailments na napagaling na dito. So, ayun. If you wanna try it for yourself, go! Kaya na ni Baby Kyrie, ah. Ano? Kaya? Kaya? Wow! Si Baby Kyrie, ang galing naman. Nakalubog sa hot spring. Ang galing naman ako 
So ang average um, temperature ng hot spring na to is 38 to 40 degrees daw. And baby Kyrie is already accustomed to it. Wow! Galing naman ng baby na yan. Masanay na agad ang bata. Kaya ba? Isa talaga sa mga highlight na tours dito sa Coron is the Makinit Hot Spring. Kaya wag na wag niyong palalagpasin Hello to. baby Kyrie! Sa Makinit Hot Springs kami! Yay! Yeah. Hello! Oh, hello daw! Hello! Hello! <laughs> While you are here, you can explore around the area. Maraming good spots dito for picture taking at syempre other spots to soak into. Also, I have suggest na kayo ay pumunta sa Mount Tapias or sa Mount Tapias View Deck. These two are the main highlights of the Coron Town Tour. So, talaga sinasuggest ko na pumunta kayo doon or gawin ninyo yung tour na yun. Pwede rin kayo mag-DIY actually, especially sa Mount Tapias. Pero sa Makinit, I suggest na kumuha kayo ng tours kasi medyo mahal yung tricycle na papunta dito. Imagine from Tag Resort to Makinit Hot Spring, I was quoted 1,000 pesos. I'm not sure kung one way na or papunta pa lang but 1,000 is definitely a large, um, large amount na diba? Kaya naman, I highly suggest na book your tours at Palawen nyo travel and tours para naman mas ma-enjoy ninyo yung inyong Coron Town Tour at yung other tours na kukunin pa ninyo. I also suggest na mag kayo for at least 3 or 4 days para ma-explore nyo yung ibang pukultahan or ibang islands dito sa Coron. Definitely, one week is a better choice. If you have more time, depende na sa inyo. But ayun, one week is actually really enough now for that. So we'll see you guys in the next vlog. Thank you for watching. Bye!